Hi, I'm Billy Beck III from Billy Beck III Personal Train Center. Today, I'm going to teach you how to tie weights on your leg. And to demonstrate this, super trainer, Brian Francis. Now, you can tie weights on your leg all day, but I'm, I'm guessing that you're tying your weights on your leg not to jump into to a lake, but to work out. So we're going to show you exactly how to do this and a workout that's challenging and effective. So the first thing we're going to do to attach this is we're going to take an attachment like this and put it on a low pulley. So the first step is to get a low pulley. Brian's going to demonstrate. He's going to take the attachment, wrap it around his ankle, and it's going to be elastic. He's going to secure the elastic, put a little tension on it just to make sure that it is ready to go. It's secure, it's fastened, and it's going to stay there. Now we're going to perform several movements that's going to get all the muscles in your lower body through your inner thigh, outer thigh, your glutes, hamstrings, your hip flexors to fire, to prepare you for exercise. We're going to do very controlled movements, only about five reps. You're going to lift it in two seconds, lower in two seconds. The first movement is a hip extension movement. Leg will be straight, the hip will go back, and then back forward. Five repetitions, and this is going to get the glutes opposite side, spinal erector or low back, and the hamstring to fire. Once you complete five reps on that side, you're going to face out and you're going to pull the weight out to the side. This is called hip abduction. The leg is going away from the body. This works the upper outer portion of the hip and it gets those muscles called the glute medius, tensor fascia lata, to then fire to prepare you to lift some big weights. Once you complete five controlled reps, you're then going to face the opposite direction, or face forward, I should say, and you're going to do hip flexion. So you're going to bend your knee up and then bring it back down. Very controlled. This also requires a lot of balance, so the opposite leg is going to be doing a lot of work too. Now then you're going to, to finish, you'll do five reps, what we call adduction, and work in the inner thighs. And this movement is going to be performed a little different because you've got to bring your leg forward, otherwise your foot will hit the ground. And if you're too close, the weight will actually hit the stack and there'll be no resistance. So make sure you're far enough away from the machine. That's how you do it. I'm Billy Beck III, and this has been How to Tie Weights on Your Leg.